Night of deadly gun violence in New York City. There have been at least six shooting incidents, and NYP data shows that shootings are on the rise. CBS News' Jenna DeAngelis is live in Prospect Lefferts Gardens this morning with more. Jenna? Chris and Mary, in those six incidents since 9.30 last night, police say 11 people were shot, and sadly, three of them died. We're on the scene of one of those deadly shootings here on Hawthorne Street. You can see investigators are still on scene. The road is still taped off as police continue to search for the suspects. A violent Wednesday night in New York City. The NYPD at the scene in Prospect Lefferts Gardens, where police say six people were shot in a drive by shooting, all rushed to area hospitals. A 23 year old man shot in the chest didn't survive. The youngest of the victims, all in their 20s. The shooting happened around 10 30 p.m. on Hawthorne Street near Nostrand Avenue. Investigators combing the area, marking bullet casings on the ground. Police say the group was standing outside when a white Infinity sedan with at least three men in the car fired and then drove off. Police still looking for the suspects here and in another deadly shooting in Bedsty, which happened about an hour earlier. Police were called to Herkimer Street near Rochester Avenue to find a 28 year old man shot multiple times. He was rushed to Kings County Hospital but didn't make it. A busy night for the NYPD also responding to a drive by shooting in the high bridge section of the Bronx on Anderson Avenue. That's where police found 23 year old Aaron Santiago shot in the head. He was pronounced dead at the hospital. The latest shooting happened around 3.30 this morning in the Tremont section of the Bronx. Police say a 32-year-old man was shot when he was simply walking. He was taken to the hospital and we're told he is in stable condition. The NYPD is reporting a 92% increase in shootings this year compared to last. And now those numbers, the shootings from last night and this morning, added to that alarming list. We're live in Prospect Lefferts Gardens. Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. Jenna, thank you.